Hello YouTube. It was a fairly nice day out today, so I had to come out and set up the forge and try my new stuff. First of all, I got my new blower set up here. And I tell you what, it works really, really well. I've already got a fire going in there because I've already been working on it, but I couldn't find a foot switch yet, but <clears throat> one of those little handy switches. And I should have known I would be right where the crud was blowing and of course I got my new hammer and I just bought a quarter inch round steel rod to play with and the first thing I made today let's get myself out of the sun here the first thing I made today is this little hook and I have to say let's see get some light on her I am very pleased with it for my first real attempt, you know. I wanted to have this upper part, I wanted to have it longer and flatter, but uh, I need to, uh, uh, you know, obviously I'm, I'm still learning. <laughs> so, but I tell you what, I am, I am uh, pleased with my first real attempt there, so. I need to get myself some metal files so I can put some finishing touches on it and all, and, and I need to figure out how to do that black, that nice black finish that folks do. I've heard some stuff about beeswax and oil and stuff, but hopefully my uh, backyard blacksmithing book will be in my mailbox tomorrow morning, and they have a chapter on finishing your work. So, anywho, hope y'all are well, and uh, I'm going to go back to having some more fun here. Bye now. Got the good lump charcoal this time. But man, I got some big old pieces. What a change that is from last time where it took like 30 minutes to get the thing glowing at all. Man. makes all the difference.
see, I still didn't make it. I still didn't make it tall enough out this way, dang it. That's a lot closer than I was wrong right there. Okay, now we get the cutter. That's about as good as I'm going to get her today. Ta-da! Another hook. Well, I had one more trick up my sleeve for today. One of the things that I've always liked about blacksmith stuff was twisting. I didn't think I'd be able to do it without a vice, but uh, I had two pliers, and... Uh, I was able to do a little twist on there. The hardest part was knowing how long to draw out the piece so that there was enough enough room to do it. I'm getting the hang of it. I'm getting the hang of it. <laughs> I think I'm done for the day. That makes three hooks I made. and I'm kind of tired. That's kind of wearing on a person. <laughs> See you later.